Happy New Year. Wonderful. My name is Christiana Do Tete. Everybody calls me Mama Christy, and I love it when they call me Mama Christy. The General Overseer of Solid Rock Chapel International in this blessed country, Ghana. Is it so wonderful? Isn't it so wonderful that God has brought us peacefully and safely to 2017? Hip, 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 hooray! Wow! You see, you made it. I also made it. And we owe it all to Jehovah God. He has made it possible for us to see today, this new year. The Bible says in his own time, he makes all things beautiful. For us as a family, Solid Rock, our team this year is overtaken. Our year of overtaking. In the things of the kingdom, overtaking is allowed. In 1 Kings 18, the Bible talks of a farming. Farming is dryness. Because I know 2016, some of you, you were full of expectations. And it looked like things didn't really work the way you expected. Cool it. Slow down. Don't worry. No shaking cram. The prophet Elijah said to Ahab that he is hearing a certain sound. The sound that is not normal. He was seeing something Ahab wasn't seeing. Ahab was the king. And so Elijah sent a message to Ahab to go and eat and drink. Whilst Elijah engaged himself in a spiritual exercise. And so he sent his servant to go and check the cloud. The young man went and came seven times. Remember 2017. And on the seventh time, he came back and said, there I see a small cloud like a man's hand. Sometimes when God wants to do something big, you don't have to see something big at the initial stage. You just see something small. But it's a sign that something big is about to happen or something good, something powerful is about to happen. It was a sign that there was going to be rain, rain of God's goodness. Ahab, because he was the king, had access to chariots. So he used his chariots to go to the gate, the city's gate, where the miracle was going to take place. But Elijah depended on the strength of God, the power of God, the might of God. This year, 2017, don't rely on your strength. Rely on the strength of God. Trust him absolutely that he will do wonders in your life. The Bible said God put speed on the Elijah's feet and he arrived at the gate of Samaria. What the man of God said, the prophet of God said, happened. There was abundance of food. Abundance of every good thing that had been denied these people for three and a half years. Listen to me. What are you hearing? Not because there's a change of government, but what is God telling you? What you are hearing with your spiritual ears is what is more important. I see you overtaking. Is it in marriage? Is it on your job? Whatever it is. Recently, we met a lady, actually last year, in Dubai. And this lady was so worried about her document. And she kept sending me messages. Mommy, I'm tired, oh, I'm tired, oh. I told her, stop saying I'm tired, oh, I'm tired, oh. Few days later, she calls me and sends me a voice message and say, Mommy, you are the first person I want to tell. 10 minutes ago, I got my resident uh, stay. You see, sometimes when we are believing God for something, we get so worried and worked up and it's like we don't even believe in what we are trusting God for. This year, fuel your faith. You will overtake. I see you overtaken. So shall be your life in every sphere. Every ramification you find yourself 
God will cause you to overtake. Your promotion that has been denied you, you will overtake. You will get double promotion, triple promotion, quadruple promotion, whatever height you want to go to. God will make it good for you. Everything good that 2017 has in store for you, I release it unto your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Receive deliverance, receive healing, receive salvation. May this year be the best of your years ever in the mighty name of Jesus. Seven stands for perfection. May the Lord perfect that which concerns you. I love you. Happy New Year.